Alright guys, welcome to Real Classic Film Reviews and welcome to the part of the channel where we have a little bit of a deep dive, a little bit of a look into uh, some classic films um, on home video and in this case it's the uh, powerhouse indicator release of uh, Mae West in Hollywood 1932 to 1943, obviously a box set featuring films from the iconic actress Mae West. Um, who acted kind of like, well, throughout throughout the 30s um, and actually into the 70s, dying in 1980, I believe. Um, now, I'm not going to pretend uh, throughout this video that I'm a Mae West expert because I'm certainly not. Um, I don't think, <laughs> crikey, I don't think I've seen any slash many of these films, so forgive me for that. Um, and that's what the purchase of this box set is essentially to remedy. Uh, and the fact that this box set exists is, you know, a pretty special uh, thing indeed um outstanding artwork there across the front if a little bit risky perhaps i don't know um obviously i've had a bit of a nightmare there trying to get that off let's have a little peek at what we've got inside um okay. there we go so this is the uh indicator set this is um number 3579 of 6000 copies uh, if you're interested in that kind of thing and they're the 10 films that it contains uh, which I believe are, it's pretty much the entirety of West's filmography. I think she made a couple more films in the 70s. Um, but this is basically, you know, like the kind of bulk of, of everything that she did. So she wasn't the most prolific actress. And I don't think she started acting until quite late in life. I think it was either in her 40s or she was 40. Um, but yeah, it was quite late on. So let's put that to one side. So, you know, amazing artwork across the set again. I mean... By this point, um, Indicator are just showing off because some of the stuff they're putting out at the moment is just ridiculous. And outside of the, you know, the kind of flagship Arrow, uh, Arrow, sorry, uh, flagship Hammer sets and um, Film Noir sets, you know, the kind of dip into some of these. They had the Deatrick, uh, Malina Deatrick set, they had the John Ford at Columbia set, some Sam Fuller stuff. They're just doing an amazing job. So, you know, you've got, 10 films in here is it two four six eight ten possibly 10 films and the booklet and we'll have a quick peek um at all them there's the spine numbers and what it looks like from the side you know as well as the Mayor west in hollywood book so you know if you if you know indicator you know what kind of uh, quality that you're going to be getting so you know that it's going to be an amazing box set um with some stunning artwork on there which it is um and then inside we'll have a quick look at the book first um which is you know comprehensive to say the least uh, and it's going to have throughout it kind of trivia on each film tech specs on each film in terms of the kind of cast and crew and the runtime and everything and then we've got uh, a variety of uh, essays in there um, you know Mayor West in Hollywood just piles and piles of different essays from different time periods um, you know essentially, essentially of history semi-history of 30s Hollywood probably is what you're going to find in there so outstanding booklet as always and then we've got the films themselves so if we go in order of release I believe 32 33 so yeah we'll start with uh you know, night after night again I apologize I don't believe I've actually seen any slash many of these so uh you'll have to forgive me for that so but you have night after night there also starring George Raft um and she'd done him wrong, so they'll be both on the same disc. Obviously, again, with it being a, an indicator set, presentation's excellent, the artwork throughout it's excellent. Um, and then we've got I'm No Angel, starring Cary Grant, no less, uh, followed by Belle of the 90s. Um, and obviously photos throughout as well behind all the discs. So just, I always love the use of kind of the original artwork across these sets. Uh, I'm going to town and uh, Klondike Annie. And then we've got Go West Young Man, also starring Randolph Scott there. And Every Day is a Holiday. Followed by um, My Little Chickadee, Mayor West and W.C. Fields. And is that just the one disc, the one film on that disc? So 
and then last but not least um the heat's on and is that tropicana or is that a or is that the different title for it so the heat's on slash tropicana um which will have been released in 43 yeah 1943 um so yeah and again outstanding artwork and photography right the way through so as a kind of snapshot of you know this kind of period of of hollywood you know to have these films together in this set in this uh, presentation is absolutely outstanding i can't wait to see what indicator do next um, i don't think i've actually seen anything in terms of what's kind of coming up from them in terms of box sets anyway um but to have something like this for an actress of you know west's kind of um historical importance to old hollywood is outstanding so super happy to have that so if you're on the fence about picking this up uh, that's a kind of quick look inside it and what you can expect to see um in the mere west in hollywood um 1932 and 1943 box set from powerhouse indicator you know if you picked up any of their sets in the past you know exactly what you're going to be getting you know the quality that you're going to be getting um and if you haven't then you know this you know why not you know get get cracking get started so we've got pretty much all of Mayor West's movies there are all important movies throughout the 30s and 40s in one set definitely one worth picking up guys so thanks for this uh, thanks for watching this quick video and I'll see you all very soon take care